Hello, welcome to MKLV Repair. In today's video we have this beautiful green Samsung Galaxy A05S and is password locked and also is Google account locked. In today's video I will show you how to remove password and how to remove Google account with the Phoenix service tool. This tool is very simple to use. Everyone can use it. In order to remove Google account you will need the phone, the bad boy computer, of course, and you will need USB cable. Let's not waste any time and I will show you. We have this beautiful Samsung A05S and how I explain it's password locked and Google account locked. Before we start removing everything we need factory reset this device. You may ask how we can do that. On newer Androids, it's a bit complicated, but simple anyway. In order to factory reset the phone, we need plug into power or into computer. Let's do that. Boom, phone is plugged. Now we need to reset. First, we need hard reset it and boot to the bootloader. To do that, for hard reset, it's power button, volume down button, and soon as this restart, switch to the volume up button. I will show you. Right. And it must be plugged into charger. Right. Power button, volume down button. And it shows this screen. It may not show. However, hold it. Pops volume up button pops let go and it should go to the bootloader let's see sometimes this can take multiple times and this time it's boot correctly i get pretty practice with it however here we need wipe cache you can navigate with the volume up and volume down button Wipe the cache, yes please, and it shows on the bottom, it's cache wipe. Now we need wipe data factory reset the phone. Wipe data factory reset the phone, and how you can see wiping data, formatting data, formatting cache. Okay, and now we just simply reboot the phone. Let's put phone down and wait for the bit. Okay, it's been a little bit and phone successfully reboot. Perfect. Let's try to set it up the phone. And how you can see on the top, it's locked. But let's confirm that by set up manually. And how you can see, my favorite thing. An authorized attempt has been made and reset the device. Okay, let's connect to the Wi Fi. I show my password, doesn't it? <laughs> I will blur out that. Guys, don't look to my password. And it's asking for the pin or Google account instead. Verify your account. Okay, let's go to the home screen. Put phone down carefully, of course. Let's not make any scratch. And now let's go to the computer. Here you can see my channel and you know the drill. Subscribe and turn all notifications on. Thank you very much. In order to remove Google account from this phone or any Samsung phone, any, 
this method works for any something. We need Phoenix service tool. You just download the tool. Simple. Just download this zip file. Like that. Download. Standard download. And it start download. Good. Also, you will need Samsung drivers. You can Google it and I will leave a link in the description. Samsung drivers, Samsung drivers, press download. Simple, right? Okay, then you install the drivers, then you go to the Phoenix tool and just open it and it will open Phoenix tool for you. Now, when Phoenix tool is downloaded and here you have tool. If you don't have account, please register one. Username, email address, password. Go back to the login and log in to tool. And here is how it looks from the inside. However, this tool is based on the credit. You may ask where you can get credit. You visit our lovely website mklvrepairs.co.uk or .com and here on the front page you can simply click to the credits and simply click most likely you will need six credits but as you go further you need more then just simply add to the basket view basket process to the checkout and here enter your email address what you register your account on the phoenix tool and then fill all information and you can pay with a card with direct bank tra transfer for the users from U united kingdom and paypal and purchase the credit and we will transfer you credit However, it will take to transfer credit, it will take about 1 to 12 hours. But usually it's done by the one hour, less than one hour. Okay, once you have credits, credits you can see here, go to the Samsung and read information. We need read the information simply because when we know all samsung drivers is installed correctly and everything is good to go and how you can see checking log status is triggered next thing simply press reset frp and it will cost two credits press yes and it will do job for you status triggered Request permission, request device data, sending unlock data, removing security, verify the status, it's unlocked. And read the information and all good to go. It's checking lock status is unlocked. How you can see on the phone, it still shows locked, but it's no longer. Let me prove you. Set up manually, turn off the Wi-Fi, skip, skip, skip. Don't copy, more, more, upset. Skip, skip anyway. And how you can see you already start setting phone as usual and you are all set did you see how simple is that very simply and also you can also turn on wi-fi make no no difference and how you can see i set it up the phone if you enjoyed this video of course please press like subscribe and see you on next one Peace.